Hi everyone, and welcome to a new Friday update. And in this one, I'll be talking about a combat overhaul I've been working on. So, uh, in the demo, the last thing you played, and it hasn't really changed that much until recently, when you would attack, you would actually do a left and a right attack animation. So, swing left, swing right, that's it. You would just do that all over, uh, kind of hack and slashy until you run out of stamina, you chill. And then you go back into the action. You have to keep an eye on that stamina meter. Um, I like that element because it means you can't just always hack and slash through everything. But it also had its downside. It, it, it could use more depth in my opinion. So that's what I tried to look at. And I now uh, changed it to combos. So instead of those two attack animations. The sword and shield for example now has six different combos. And all of them uh, are comprised of three to six attack animations. So let me just uh, show you. Uh, I can still spam. I'll show that first. Hack and slash. So now I'm just clicking rapidly. You'll see he'll do a bunch of different animations. He'll basically take the first animation from uh, random combos. Uh, and you'll see that the stamina bar goes down pretty rapidly. But what if uh, you time your attacks so when he's done swinging you click again goes on to the next one let's have a look at that as you can see there's now more animations you know they now follow each other up properly and you can see that the last one is a pretty big hit so those will do more damage and not just that look at the stamina bar it doesn't really go down that much so as you uh, perform successful uh, clicks, if you click at the right time, you'll actually get to do more damage. You'll do more damage because you get in further into the combo and you'll get um, critical damage because you clicked at the right time. So it's not random anymore, the critical. It's if you click at the right time. And you get to regain some stamina for successful hits because you're really in control instead of just, you know, swinging it around. So let's just go and attack some people. There's also a lot more visual feedback. So as you, as you, as you see, I hit him. The last hit was 37, which is a lot for this weapon because usually it does around 11. Uh, 11. Elf, that's Dutch. Uh, 11. <laughs> oh, that's one of my favorites, the, the shield attack. And yeah, let's finish this guy. You also see slow motion. You can still do the heavy attack. That hasn't really ch oh, changed. Now I'm low on stamina. And that slow motion works. Um, basically, as you kill someone you'll get a, a short slow motion sequence. Now, maybe I'll add some options for this. Maybe I'll, I'll change that around. Currently, it works on humanoid enemies, but uh, we'll see in the future how people respond to this. Currently, I really like it. So right now I have the sword and a shield. Let's kill these guys. There's a lot more visual feedback, like I said before. Bam. You, you get opportunities to do a lot more damage. I think in the in the main game you'll have to actually learn these uh, these combos as you play it. Stab. Bam. Death. So a lot more depth to the system. I hope you to like this Friday update. I hope I get to share more of this new combat in the future by showing off different weapons and all their uh, and all of their attacks. And if you have any feedback, please let me know. If you've not wishlisted us on Steam yet, that would, that would be greatly appreciated. And if you could share it uh, with friends, that'd also be really appreciated. We've been having a bit of a rough time on Steam for the last uh, month or two months since their, their update. And uh, we lost a lot of uh, viewers, like a lot of other indie developers. So yeah. Any help would be greatly appreciated. Alright, thank you so much for watching. Apologies for this one being delayed. I hope it was worth it. I hope I talked about most of the important things. Otherwise, you probably saw it. Or you'll get to see it at some point. <laughs> uh, okay, thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.